Welcome to Trash World News Tutorial 3. Let's jump straight into it. File 199 contains exactly two values, a keyword and a number. As we can see here, we've got echo and the number is 9780. Create a new file in the out box and copy those two values into it, swapping their order so that the number, th the number is first. When you are finished, delete file 199. Awesome. So let's start off by creating our first exa. And we're going to do the obvious. We're going to go link 800. And then we're going to jump into the secret room by doing link 799. Just to make sure that works. Cool. Now we're just going to grab 199 to pick up the file. Yep. And now we've got two options here. If we walk through the and have a look at the guide on how to complete this task, Gus walk through it. Let's actually bring this up now. Cool. Just make this a bigger so you can read it. Now if you have read through the guidebook, it basically tells us that for this particular s stage we need to look at how we can uh, interface two different uh, X's together using the uh, global variable here, this M variable. So we're going to take advantage of that. We're going to create a second XOR. We're going to do link 800 and link 800 again to have it walk to this outbox here. Confirm that works being destroyed because it doesn't have any tasks to do. We're going to run the make task. So this make command will create a new file and put it in the hands of the exa. So we should end up with this exa holding a new file that we're able to write to. Then what we're going to do is we're going to publish the data from this file here to the global memory. We can do that for exa1 by doing copy fm. And what this is going to do is it's going to copy the uh, first value in this file to the global memory space for our other X to copy from. So then we're going to do copy mf. Now I realize there's a problem here, but I'm going to show you what how this works to start with. So we again we copy echo into the memory, and then this X copies echo into its file. However, the task wants us to make sure that the number is swapped so that the number appears first. Now in order to get around this, what we're going to do is instead of copying from memory to the file directly, we're going to copy from memory to our X register to start with. Then what we're going to do is when we copy in the second value, we're going to copy that value from memory to the file, and then finally copy from our register to the file. So this will effectively reverse the values. Then we'll run halt. And the final requirement is that we delete the file when we're done. So we'll run the white phrase, and then halt as well. And that's it. Confirm this works for all of them. And we're good to move on.